We got the y'all them back. Yo, bro, I don't know if y'all. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This nigga. I don't know if y'all know, son. The nigga had a starting lineup, bro, at one point. The nigga be swapping them out. Okay, he bringing them back. Yo, D. I'm not, I, I ain't gonna lie. DR, I'm going to DR for my birthday, son. At first, it was Columbia, but Columbia is on some shit. I don't think I, I, don't think I should go to hell for this seat. Hey guys, this is Jamo, and I'm very excited to make you another video. So guys, right now I'm here in San Domingo, Dominican Republic, uh, in, in Zona Colonial. And guys, a lot of people have been asking me, Jamo, how do you find new chicas in the DR? Which, which is a great question. I, and also somebody asked me that even on- Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna violate, but this niggas be killing me, bro, with the suit collection with the tie. This is kind of getting me tight a little bit. But he, Twitter, recently. And guys, I want to say, if you haven't followed me on Twitter, you know, go ahead and get that nah. done. But anyways, guys, yeah, you know, I haven't been in Sasua as much recently because I've been teaching English here in uh, Dominican Republic, or here in San Domingo, and also I've been in Punta Cana more. So I haven't been able to get those Sasua numbers. But the way that I've been able to find new chicas that you see in the videos, and also but just, you know, for Spanish. personal life as well, is through an app called Crema. Guys, this, this dating app oh, has been around for about, is... for about a year, I'd say. And, you know, it's basically, the setup is kind of like Tinder meets TikTok, so it's very cool. And obviously, when the guys think about uh, dating apps, they think about, oh, you know, am I going to be catfish? That's obviously a big concern, which is a valid concern because right. uh, you know I've you been catfish here in Dominican Republic, so yeah. I, I, I can understand that 110. percent But the way that it's set up is actually you can do a virtual date, a virtual lunch date, or a virtual dinner date before you even meet the chica. So that's the, so that's kind of cool. So that kind of mitigates uh, those concerns. Or you can do even like a five minute drink date as well so i think that's very helpful uh mitigating those catfish concerns obviously uh and obviously um there are beautiful women in dominican Republic Fast. that you can find on the app but also they have users in colombia and other latin american countries also they have users uh in thailand and other southeast asian countries so to be honest with you I would highly recommend using the app just because there are a lot of beautiful women that are looking to have a good time, looking to have fun, and also they're very accessible. And even to the point where, actually, I'm about to go on a date with a woman that I met from Crema in the Botanical Gardens uh, a little bit after I finished teaching English. So guys, I highly recommend the app. And uh, yeah, so guys, I, you know, continue to watch the video. And guys, and let's get it. Oh, whoa, 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 Giamma. First of all, you killing me, bro, because you keep doing this shit and backing out the... I never seen a nigga... on oh, my fault. I never seen a nigga in my life, bro. The nigga backs out a, a Puma, like... Nah, it's not even a crew. I thought it was a V-neck. I thought it was a crew neck. This nigga has a button-up Puma, dude. Like, shirt. Collared. Pulling them. This is to show you, my nigga. Go to, go to another. Oh uh, boy. I was reading the wrong prices. I wonder if you just tell them like, hey, I'm gonna reward you. This nigga know exactly what he's doing on that little ass GoPro. I wanna know if all these shits be natural. Yo, I do this at, I do this in America, bro. You telling me I can go to DR and take pictures of shorties. Get paid and live good. And that attracts more vibes. I see why niggas started passport, bro. You couldn't bueno, come to America and do no shit. Yo like quiero this. decir a ti es como tú parece más bonita en persona Maybe. que la aplicación de crema. Gracias. Mm, sí, sí. Y dime qué qué pensaste de este este te gusta esta cita. Sí, me gustó mucho el lugar y es todo divertido, es cool aquí. Sí, es es muy bonita aquí. Sí. Como tú. De verdad. <laughs> <laughs> sí, sí. Y uh, y dime, sí, you know, sí. yo quiero saber un poco más de ti es como 
um, tú qué, qué buscas, qué cualidades buscas en, en un hombre serio? Un chico claro, que sea detallista, uh -huh. eh, educado. Uh -huh responsable, etc. Ok, sure. y tú dices educado, es como tú estás hablando sobre un hombre que ir a la universidad o... No, 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 sino una gente bien portada. Mm, okay. Así que tenga buen comportamiento sería la palabra. Ok, interesante, interesante. Ok, bueno, yo quiero decir, you know, gracias para ir a esta cita conmigo, pero yo creo eso es um, todo, you know, por hoy, de verdad. Ah. Sí, porque de verdad yo solo traigo you know, 40 dólares por, por este sitio solo para venir aquí, así so que quiero decir gracias para venir. Ah, yo pensé que iríamos a conocer más de Santo Domingo este oh, día. ¿Tú quieres disfrutar más de Santo Domingo? Sí, para que tú conozcas mi país. Ok, bueno, yo, yo no traigo, solo traigo 40 dólares, pero podemos ir a un parque y caminar un claro poco. Claro que sí. Ok, bueno, 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 vamos, vamos. I get why he got this GoPro to, you know what happened? Big ass camera and shit walking around. You know, if you're an American man and you're not having the success you want as far as dating, you come to a foreign country and you have a lot more opportunity Yo, and access, is, you start to go crazy. This nigga Giamo is fooling the vibes to sit on top of, this is somebody's coffee table, gang. In a sauna. With a low ass 40, 45 inch TV and a shed. And he's taking a picture on a fucking. What is this? A 12C? I'm not mad at the hustle, but this should motivate y'all niggas, bro. Passport bros, the new generation, next generation nigga, go out there and get litty. He got shorty toured it up on what looks like a jewelry desk, a jewelry table. And a lodge or some shit, cause it's towels and shit. This look like the sauna room, my nigga. Little ass TV mounting on the wall. He taking pictures. Come on, son. Lock in. Crazy. That kind of throws things off, man. It makes an imbalance, if you will, in the you force and the like system. Off of fucking YouTube. You know what I'm saying? I mean, of, um, For instance, I posted a video man, about a. The, hold on. Hold on. Perspective. This is a B and B with a toaster, some aloe, a couple plates, not no dishes. This I don't even know if this is her crib. Not even real wooden shit, and she up their feet on a on a fucking nice fine countertop, marble shit. Low ass dress on. He's taking pictures off of eleven C, nigga. Y'all niggas ain't working hard enough. I'm 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 like, and she's with it. What's going with on in the sewer, the Dominican back. Republic? A lot of guys going this. down there, treat the place like a strip club. Tell, you I'm know, disrespectful, speak. loud, throwing money around. You're upsetting the imbalance of things, you know. I didn't. I wasn't going down there in the 90s. I wasn't young enough, Wait, oh, but I heard stories of guys going down, down there, you know, having a nice time with a young lady for oh, 50 that's bucks phone. or something, you know, for a couple of days. <laughs> you try to offer that to a young lady now, man, she's going to laugh in your face. Hey, guys, I wanted to react to that audio clip because I thought it was very interesting. I know it's kind of old, but... Guys, um, you know, like the title says, making $40 great again uh, is definitely possible in Dominican Republic. But, you know, as the guy mentioned, if you go to Sasua, if you go to Punta Cana, you know, it's going to be difficult to make $40 great again. I'm going to be honest with you. You know, to me, in my mind, if that's if that's the type of time you're on, um, there's a couple of different Wait. elements that are really involved. The first thing you have to ask yourself is, you know, do you have gain? Do you have enough game, you know, to get it down to that 50, 40 ball? You know what I'm saying? That That's really the oh, and when I say on. game. I'm not talking about like, you know, how you pick up game or whatnot. Like, do you have enough Spanish to even do that? So that's really number one. We're talking about, you know, Chicas in Dominican Republic. Uh, the second thing to... that you really have to consider here is also like what type of Chicas are you really going for? You know, if you're going for the hottest of hottest Chicas, you know. It's gonna be difficult to make forty dollars great again. I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm gonna keep it. Oh, I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep it a buck. I'm gonna keep it a buck. So that's something that also you have, you have to, you know, really look at your expectations. And then the third thing you really right. have to look for. Hold on, before you tell us the third thing, hey gang, this is how niggas get cased up. <laughs> he is. This is the. This is what the interviews that niggas, the rappers be doing, and they get cased up, and niggas be wondering, yo, niggas telling, no, nigga, you giving the fucking freak bill away, bro. You in 4K, you saying it without saying it. Like, where are you peak. looking? 
As I said, if you're looking into Sua, like he said, chicas will laugh at you. Point blank, straight up. That's I'm that's 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 facts. But if you're looking in La Vega, if you're looking in Mocha, if you're looking in Samana, if you're looking in La Miches and whatnot, then you know that's it's definitely like possible to make forty dollars great again. No. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be honest with you. Oh. Oh, hola. Hola. Oh, oh. Oh, tu ves, oh, muy bonita. Blanco, es un bien color para ti. Si, si, si. Yo. He's, let, he's free gaming, y'all niggas, bro. He got the B&B &B set up, the towels ready. The, the That little ass baby, I don't know what that's going to do with, you know what I'm saying? BBL gobblers over here, but you know what I'm saying? Do your thing, son. Oh. Ah, uh, si, sí, si, sí, yeah, yeah, es, es, es cerca de aquí, de aquí. Ok, bueno, bueno, vamos, vamos. <laughs> Sixty, nigga. Tuh. Sixty U.S. cash for two. I mean, I don't know what y'all niggas is out there spinning, bro. I don't know. I don't want to know. I can't partake. Spinning bread. I'm already in a foreign country. I'm scared to touch anything. Strip club. I need gloves on. Now I'm chatting, but I. You feel me? I. I won't partake in this kind of way. The bad bitch, you could just be around. And you know what I'm saying? And the atmosphere and the ozone layers and all that in the clubs or whatever. But I I can't do it, son. That shit is scary. Y'all niggas wrap it up out there though, you heard? Right? Safety and don't get cased up. That might be I might that might be some other shit. Y'all niggas be safe though, you heard? Right? 